Good morning, everyone. I'm William Perry White Jr. with your morning digital news brief for this Wednesday, July 20th. The National League got embarrassed not winning against the American League All-Stars as they lost 3-2. Giancarlo Stanton was the MVP for this year by crushing a two-run home run, traveling 457 feet in diameter, and that's where the home run landed deep in the left field pavilion at Dodger Stadium in Los Angeles. Tonight's ESPY Awards is coming on later at 8 o'clock exclusively on the networks of ABC, a parent company of Disney. That award ceremony will be hosted by 2022 NBA Finals MVP Stephen Curry. With temperatures soaring in our area and parts of the country, the White House said that President Biden is considering declaring a national climate emergency, and that will help free up and start to fight climate change. 12 million Americans or more will now live in regions being covered by excessive heat advisories. Our 46th president will be in Massachusetts by visiting a former coal plant that is now making parts for windmills offshore. Based on the National Weather Service, they believe that 60 new record highs will be set across 20 states by the end of this week. Here's meteorologist Larissa Abreu with her Eyewitness News most up-to-date seven-day forecast from CBS3. All right, Larissa, thank you. Remember, you can always get Larissa's most up-to-date forecasts and the latest stories right here on cbsphilly.com. That's the latest for your morning digital news brief. My name is William. I hope all of you will have a great Wednesday.